This video shows you how you can create your own templates. First, open up a new part file. Then, in the file, change the settings you would like to be changed. The default units are in millimeters, so let's change them to inches. Go to the settings and click Document Properties. Click on Units and then change it from millimeters, grams, and seconds to inch, pounds, and seconds. Then click OK. To save this file as a part template, go to the drop down arrow next to the Save button and click Save As. In the pop up window, change the file type to Part Template. Create a new folder in My Documents that you can add all of your templates to. Change the file name and save it in that folder. Now go back to your settings and click on File Locations. Make sure the drop down menu shows Document Templates and then click Add. Find the folder we just created for your templates, and then click OK. Click OK on the property windows too. Now when we go to make a new document, click on Advanced. You will see a tab with your folder name in it at the top. Click it, and you will find the templates you have added to it. Double click your template to open it, and you can begin to use it. You can also make templates for assemblies and drawings that you can use with your team. Our team has a folder of templates we call SimPad. It contains standard parts including hex shafts, thunder hex, L channel, and sheet metal parts, and many more. If you're a SimBot, please add this folder now as it will become useful during the season. That is everything for this video. Hopefully you have learned how to easily create templates for your team.